story and everything and tell me who you are and what you're story. doing and stuff. Yeah. My name's Lisa and this is Kenny, my husband, and I've been checking collins for about three years. And I, I really enjoy doing it. I've been doing it for about 40 years. <laughs> he hasn't been doing it for 40 years, have you? So I've been here and I've done it as a kid, you know? Yeah. Uh, I'd I say good 30. I just never ain't done it. Like this, we always done it to shut the meat for the restaurant. Back then they used to let it drag, you know? Yeah. Now they have the limits and everything, regulations. And they don't anymore uh, let you just go out there and get what you want. The government's got to get in everything. You know how it is. <laughs> But just like y'all, we are celebrating our seventh wedding anniversary next month. And y'all look very happy, and we are very happy. So seven must be very good. Seven's awesome. Seven's awesome. It took us a couple years just to get you on. Yeah, sure did. We got married very fast. We had only... We had only known each other three days oh my God. and said, I love you. And seven days after that, he asked me to marry him. Aww. And then two months after we got together, we were married. Wow. And then happily married. And happily married. We were very happily married. And happily married. Yeah, I knew her, I knew her for, what, three days and I should marry her or something like that? You knew me seven, for ten days. Ten days. It was seven days after you said that you loved me and I said I loved you. And then we got married. And yeah. it's awesome ever since? Ever since. Ever it gets better every year. Ain't nothing better than that, right? Right. I know, I know what you're it talking about. It gets better about. every year. It gets better and better and better. That's right. I'm going to grow old with my father. Grow old? You already are old. Hey, easy, mama. <laughs> All right, so let me slow what you're doing quick. All right, let me start over and I'll start with one. Okay. Give me a lesson. Tell me what a you're lesson. doing. A lesson. You take your scallop, and I'm doing it right-handed. It's opposite if you're left-handed. You take the light-colored side down, dark-colored side up, and if they're not open, you take your knife, just a tiny little crack right there, and you stick your knife in there just a little bit. Just kind of wedge it open a little bit. Use your Stick finger your to hold it open. Don't want to. You don't want to pull it open because you'll rip it in half. Take your knife and scrape it along the top. Discard the top, and then you'll want to come around behind the um, the waist in the back there, and you'll pull it off just like that, and then you scrape it right out. How is that? That's awesome. Isn't that easy? So a lot of people will use the vacuum and so forth, and that's pretty nasty. Yeah, and you know, you well, we've done it many times, but I'm hooked on this. They take, you have, uh, it's usually it takes three people to do the vacuum. Yep. We have, to, we have to have a whole system. Because you have one person that cuts it open, on one yep. person that sucks the the, the guts out. Then you have another person who cuts the meat out. Yep. Yep. And it usually takes longer. Um, today, uh, yes, my partner and I, she, she shucks about the same speed that I do. Her and I are about, about equal. How many can you shuck an hour? I don't know. How many you shuck today? Um, that, that whole bucket full. Oh my yeah, there's some in there, but I'm saying probably I didn't do that many that are in there. The, the girl that was helping me and Kenny probably did was in there. But today we watched, um, there was some people using the vacuum and they had, actually I think they had four people. And it was fun and watching them do it and we were doing it. They had a cooler and we had a cooler and her and I did the cooler together. We shared it. And we were finished with our cooler long before. <laughs> I, I'm saying probably an hour and a half. Really? Before they were done. Because yeah. they had one person and, and cut it out and everything. 
Okay, so you have to double the time because her and I were shucking at the same time on the same cooler. Right, but they had how many people doing it? They had four people. Yep. And it just, it, it was a lot longer. But some people swear by the vacuum, they love it. We and do, but I'm definitely hooked on this. I can't wait to try that. Once you're, you, you learn how to do it and you have the procedure down, you can work on your speed. Yeah. Just, that's like with anything, you know? Yep, yeah. yep. Once you get the knack. Right. But. Where are you? In case I put this on the internet. Well, I'm going to ask you first, but anyway. We are in Steenhatchee, Florida, right on the mouth of the Steenhatchee River. Is it awesome here? It is. We're having so much fun. <laughs> it's a small little fishing community. The Steenhatchee River divides Taylor County and Dixie County, County of Florida. We are on the Dixie County side right now. If you look across the river, you're looking at Taylor County. The best. The we, we, we go to Crystal River too, and it's a lot of fun. We love it, but this is a different league as far as yeah. how many. It's a different kind of community, also, yeah. than in Crystal River. Yep. Yeah, my dad lives down in Pasco County, and, and Crystal River is just a different, you know. All right, say goodbye. Bye. Am I okay to put it on the internet? Yes. It's if a you, tutorial. I'll be nice. If you will give me the address and everything of where I can look at it. Okay. You have my permission. My okay. Name's Lisa Morrow. You can my my what is it called? I'll have you write it down. Over okay. There. Okay. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you for the, bye bye. Thank you for the tutorial. It was awesome. I can't wait. Okay. Bye. Bye.